everybody, welcome back to 3 Minute English with Mitch, and this is where I'm giving you a few tips, pointers, and phrases, things you can use to help you speak English like a native English speaker. So today I want to focus on a phrase, very simple phrase, have your hands full. What does it mean to have your hands full? A couple videos ago, you may remember that we talked about the phrase a handful. He's a handful, right? Someone who's very difficult to manage, right? Well, this is similar, it's related to that. When you have your hands full, it could be because someone is a handful, that could be the reason, or it could just be any reason, really. It just means you're very busy. That's it. It's very simple. It just means you're very busy. You don't have a lot of time, you're working very hard on something, so you have your hands full. And we often use the preposition with. I have my hands full with my final exams, or I have my hands full with taking care of my children or any anything uh, you can say okay that, that keeps you busy something that keeps you busy you can say you have your hands full and it, it really just means you can't carry any more responsibility you're full it's it's the limit okay so let me give you some examples of this uh, you could say hey you have your hands full already with this report so I don't want to give you any more work Maybe your boss would say that. What a dream boss. That sounds like a great boss. Does your boss say that? You you have your hands full already with this report. You're so busy. I don't want to give you any more work. Just go ahead and finish that. Okay? That'd be a nice boss. Uh, she's got her hands full with him. He's always going to the club without telling her. Her boyfriend, you know, he's always in the club. He's always there. She's got her hands full with him. So, in other words... She's, it's difficult to manage because he's a handful. So because of that, she's very busy. She's very tired, very, you know, maybe upset, whatever. It could be many different reactions. But the, the main line, the bottom line is he's difficult to manage and she can't take any more. Her hands are full. Uh, I have my hands full with the twins. They're really a handful. The twins, you know, have you ever had twins? I don't know if you do. I don't have twins. I can't imagine. It must be difficult. They are a handful, so you have your hands full. You have your hands full. So you see, those two phrases are very closely related, but not exactly the same. So they're a little different. Try to use it in the comments section below, and that will help you. 